Hey there YouTubers unboxing video. Hey, if you haven't liked and subscribed to the channel, please do that now. All right. So let's go ahead and get in this unboxing. This should be a used B560 motherboard. Um, you know, this motherboard interested me a lot for multiple reasons. One, it's uh, great for 11 gen, right? 10th and 11th gen. Interesting uh, packing job. I guess I'm not getting a uh, motherboard box. Who knows what I signed up for? Um, wow. This is interesting. So this is one of the biggest sellers on uh, eBay for refurbed motherboards. And wow, that is just piss poor. I would never expect this from a a company with 20,000 feedback. Holy cow. Like, who the hell just throws shit in here? There's my IO shield. Right? Mounting bracket, which I'm not even sure why they included that, right? Because uh, I think this supposedly came from an HP computer. This is just... You know, it'd be one thing to put it in a different bag and then put that on top of it like you would get in a motherboard box, but you just have it be able to slide all over the place. Um, kind of scares me, right? So let's look for damage real fast. Looks like it's probably okay. All right, so what do we have for features, folks? Um, Obviously, LGA 1200 CPU goes here. Let's pop that open, make sure there's no damage. And a lot of times you buy these things. And the way this, this was set up, Christ, I wouldn't be surprised if there was damage. Okay, four uh, slots for DDR4 RAM. Here's your 24 pin connector. You've got uh, some RGB stuff here. Here's your CPU fan header. USB 3.2, another uh, fan header. Type C Charlie, six SATAs. All right, front panel connectors. Another uh, case fan header, so that's two. USB, oh, these are USB 2.0s. HD audio. Now, this is awesome. PCIe 4.0, 3.0. Um, great for, you know, obviously multiple graphics cards. M.2, PCIe 5.0, and a regular, uh, so Gen 3, Gen 4. What else? So two of those. Eight, one by eight for CPU power. Another fan header here. And this one is Wi-Fi, so that's good. Microphone, headphone, line out, USB 3.0, Type-C, Ethernet, display port, HDMI, and two USB 2.0s. Nothing on the back of this one. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's the item. Um, CMOS battery right there, I missed that. This doesn't have any of the 1-inch or 4-inch PCIe, so it's great for... That unless you were going to use this, uh, if you're mine, wanting to mine with it, um, these are not good to plug those one inchers in. They'll potentially melt your cables. So yeah, this is a uh, this is a nice looking motherboard. Hopefully it's not damaged. Not sure what CPU I'll put it in. Put in it. I would have liked to put my i5 11400 in it. I think this would be a good match for it. And then. Who knows what graphics card, cards, it'll get at least two cards in it. But yeah, so we will do a BIOS update on this. We will also do a BIOS overview. And uh, maybe, you know, eventually I'll do a review on it. We'll see if I like it. Let's just hope it works, folks. Like I said, you know, pretty stupid to uh, have these things sliding around like that. Um, 
Yeah, I'm really disappointed. I actually bought three different motherboards from these guys. So the fact that that's the kind of quality I have to look forward to kind of scares me. But, uh, you know, it is what it is, right? They're busy, I'm sure, for the holidays. Uh, hey, thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.